Good morning, brothers and sisters. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in which you partake, you partake of Christ, whose sufferings, sufferings are remembered, our minds are filled with His grace, grace and, and we receive the pledge of glory which is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food. And this bread contain all goodness. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you give us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of the sacrament of body and blood help us to experience the salvation you want for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Queen of heaven, rejoice. Alleluia. For he whom you did marry to bear. Alleluia. Has risen as he said. Alleluia. Pray for us to God, Alleluia. Rejoice and be glad, O Virgin Mary, Alleluia. For the Lord is truly risen, Alleluia. Let us pray. O God, God who give joy to the world, to the resurrection of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, grant we beseech you that through the intercession of the Virgin Mary's mother, we may obtain the joys of everlasting life. Through the same Christ, our Lord, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall clear praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Luminous Mystery The First Luminous Mystery The Baptism of the Lord our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Second Luminous Mystery the wedding at Cana. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. 
Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third luminous mystery, the proclamation of the kingdom of God. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth luminous mystery, the transfiguration. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of praise, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of praise, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of praise, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of praise, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fifth luminous mystery, the institution of the Holy Eucharist. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother, Mother of mercy. mercy. Hail, Hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To you do we cry for banished children of Eve. To you do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious Advocate, your eyes of mercy toward us. And after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of your womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawa, pray for us that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, o God whose, whose only begotten Son, by His life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, grant we beseech you that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Prayer to St. Joseph Behold the faithful and prudent steward whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him in splendid garments. Let us pray. Father, you entrusted our Savior to the care of St. Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may your church continue to serve our Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit. One God, forever and ever. Amen. Jubilee Prayer for the Golden Anniversary of the Dominican Province of the Philippines O God, our Father and Creator, in whom we live and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this Jubilee of the Dominican Province of the Philippines. O God, the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose love we strive to incarnate. O God, the Holy Spirit, advocate and guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of your words and works, in the consecration of our lives to the holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you, that our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all in the gospel we share to all peoples by your will O god in your name o lord amen our lady of the holy rosary pray for us our holy father san dominic pray for us please be seated for a while 
Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. Today is the, is the feast day of St. Catherine of Siena, the Dominican Virgin and Doctor of the Church. Catherine Benincasa was born at Siena, Italy in 1347, the youngest of 25 children. Inspired by divine grace, she vowed her virginity to God while still a small girl, and after overcoming the objections of her family, pursued a life of prayer and penance as a sister of penance of St. Dominic. She continued in this way of life until, until 1370, when in a vision, God asked her to undertake an active apostolate and become involved in the affairs of her age. Several times, she was able to bring about peace among the Italian city-states and, while representing the Florentines at Avignon, was instrumental in persuading Pope Gregory XI to return to Rome. On April 1, 1375, by divine favor, she received the stigmata. The dialogue, which she left for a large family of disciples, is a masterpiece of spiritual and theological doctrine and has become a source of riches for the entire Dominican family. She died in Rome on April 29, 1380, and was buried in the Basilica of Santa Maria Sopra Minerva. In 1970, Pope Paul VI declared her a doctor of the church. We will now have the morning prayer of the church, integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. Come, let us worship the Lord, source of all wisdom. Alleluia. Come, let us worship the Lord, source of all wisdom. Alleluia. Come, let us sing to the Lord, and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach him with praise and thanksgiving, and sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come, let us worship the Lord, source of all wisdom. Alleluia. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in His hands the depths of the earth, and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea it belongs to Him, the dry land too, for it was formed by His hands. Come, let us worship the Lord, source of all wisdom. Alleluia. Come, then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For He is our God, and we are His people the flock his shepherds come let us worship the lord source of all wisdom alleluia today listen to the voice of the lord do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness when at mary by in massa they challenged me and provoked me although they had seen all of my works come let us worship the lord source of all wisdom alleluia 40 years i entered that generation i say there are people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. Come, let us worship the Lord, source of all wisdom. Alleluia. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us worship the Lord, source of all wisdom. Alleluia. Peace be seated. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and am humble of heart. Alleluia. O God, you are my God, for you I long. For you my soul is thirsting. My body pines for you, like a dry, weary land without water. So I gaze on you in the sanctuary to see your strength and your glory. 
for your love is better than life. My lips will speak your praise. So I will bless you all my life. In your name I will lift up my hands. My soul shall be filled as with a banquet. My mouth shall praise you with joy. On my bed I remember you. On you I muse through the night. For you have been my help. In the shadow of your wings I rejoice. My soul clings to you. Your right hand holds me fast. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Blessed are they who are persecuted for the sake of justice. The kingdom of God is theirs. Alleluia. Bless the Lord, all you works of the Lord. Praise and exalt Him above all forever. Angels of the Lord, bless the Lord. You heavens, bless the Lord. All you waters above the heavens, bless the Lord. All you hosts of the Lord, bless the Lord. Sun and moon, bless the Lord. Stars of heaven, bless the Lord. Every shower and dew, bless the Lord. All you winds, bless the Lord. Fire and heat, bless the Lord. Cold and chill, bless the Lord. Dew and rain, bless the Lord. Frost and chill, bless the Lord. Ice and snow, bless the Lord. Nights and days, bless the Lord. Light and darkness, bless the Lord. Lightnings and clouds, bless the Lord. Let the earth bless the Lord. Praise and exalt Him above all forever. Mountains and hills, bless the Lord. Everything growing from the earth, bless the Lord. You springs, bless the Lord. Seas and rivers, bless the Lord. You dolphins and all water creatures, bless the Lord. All you birds of the air, bless the Lord. All you beasts, wild and tame, bless the Lord. You sons of men, bless the Lord. O Israel, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt Him above all forever. Priests of the Lord, bless the Lord. Servants of the Lord, bless the Lord. Spirits and souls of the just, bless the Lord. Holy men of humble heart, bless the Lord. Ananiah, Azariah, Misael, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt Him above all forever. Let us bless the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Let us praise and exalt Him above all forever. Blessed are you, Lord, in the firmament of heaven, praiseworthy and glorious and exalted above all forever. May God be honored in all things through Jesus Christ. To Him be glory and power forever and ever. Alleluia. Sing a new song to the Lord, His praise in the assembly of the faithful. Let Israel rejoice in its Maker. Let Zion's sons exult in their King. Let them praise His name with dancing and make music with timbrel and harp. For the Lord takes delight in His people. He crowns the poor with salvation. Let the faithful rejoice in their glory, shout for joy and take their rest. Let the praise of God be on their lips and a two-edged sword in their hand. To the Lord vengeance to the nations and punishment on all the peoples to bind their kings in chains and their nobles in fetters of iron to carry out the sentence preordained this honor is for all is faithful glory to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit as it was in the beginning is now and will be forever amen please stand let us pray God of wisdom, you made St. Catherine burn with divine love in contemplating the Lord's passion and in serving your church. With the help of our prayers, may your people, united in the mystery of Christ, rejoice forever in the revelation of his glory. Who lives and reigns with you, and the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the book of Revelation. Grace and peace from Jesus Christ, the faithful witness, the firstborn from the dead and ruler of the kings of earth. To him who loves us and freed us from our sins by his own blood, who has made us, made us a royal nation of priests in the service of his God and Father. To him be glory and power forever and ever. Amen. See, he comes amid the clouds. 
every eye shall see him, even of those who pierced him. All the peoples of the earth shall lament him bitterly. So it is to be. Amen. The Lord God says, I am the Alpha and the Omega, the one who is and who was and who is to come, the Almighty. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. O oh, bless the Lord, my soul. O oh, bless the Lord, my soul. My soul give thanks to the Lord. All my being bless His holy name. My soul give thanks to the Lord and never forget all His blessings. O oh, bless the Lord, my soul. It is He who forgives all your guilt, who heals every one of your ills, who redeems your life from the grave, who crowns you with love and compassion. O oh, bless the Lord, my soul. The Lord is compassion and love, slow to anger and rich in mercy. His wrath will come to an end. He will not be angry forever. O oh, bless the Lord, my soul. Please stand. If anyone thirst, let him come to me. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus went into the temple area and began to teach. The Jews were filled with amazement and said, How did this man get his education? when he had no teacher. This was Jesus' answer. My doctrine is not my own. It comes from him who sent me. Anyone who chooses to do his will will know about this doctrine, namely, whether it comes from God or it is simply spoken on my own. Whoever speaks on his own is bent on self-glorification. The man who seeks glory for him who sent him is truthful. There is no dishonesty in his heart. If anyone thirsts, let him come to me. Let him drink who believes in me. Scripture has it. From within him, rivers of living water shall flow. Here he was referring to the Spirit whom those that came to believe in him were to receive. There was of course, no spirit as yet, since Jesus had not yet been glorified. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Sa panahon ngayon, matutuwa ka at malulungkot ka rin sa mga pangyayari. Sa panahon kung saan tayo ay naghihirap dahil sa pandemic, sa panahon kung maraming tao ay nagugutom dahil 
sa walang trabaho, ang Diyos ay gumagawa ng paraan. Pinapakita pa rin ng Diyos na hanggang ngayon kasama natin siya. Ang Diyos ay hindi pabaya. Patuloy at patuloy pa rin ang kanyang pagpakita sa kanyang pagkaama na maawain at mapagmahal. At ito lahat ay makikita natin sa mga pangyayari sa ating komunidad. Alam nyo, sa una, talagang uh, tuwang-tuwa ako sa pagsulputan o sa pagsimula nitong community pantry sa Maginhawa. At pagkatapos na Maginhawa, nagsulputan hindi lamang sa Metro Manila, ngunit sa mga probinsya at hindi lamang dito sa Pilipinas, ngunit sa Indonesia, sa Timor Leste. At kung tingnan natin na malalim, saan natin ma kita ang similarity nito? Of course, We remember the multiplication of the bread. And that multiplication of the bread originated from the sharing, from the sharing of five loaves and two pieces of fish. It multiplies because somebody shares. And I believe that that person was touched by God. Ang nakakalungkot lang sa nangyayari na maraming tao nagdududa, pinagdududahan itong napakagandang pangyayari para matulungan yung mga nagugutom at nangangailangan. Pinagdudahan na hindi ito tama, ngunit ginamit lamang. But then the reality is that a lot of people were able to eat, were able to get the necessities that they need in their life in order to survive, in order to live. We do not believe that it is coming from God because Probably, we do not believe in God. We do not believe in God because we do not know how to obey God. Kaya ito nangyayari ng mga pagdududa. Isa pa. Nagka-problema yung ibang mga community pantries because yung ibang tao ay kumukuha ng sobra sa kanilang pangangailangan. There is that kind of thinking that They are entitled to get what they want. The mga self-entitlement, 
na sinasabi, karapatan ko ito, karapat dapat ko matanggap ito. At ito, ang magkaproblema kapag ganitong prinsipyo ang umiiral sa atin. Marami pa rin magugutom. At bakit? Kasi hindi ka nag... Hindi mo naunawaan yung ibang tao. Ay nuuna mo lamang yung sarili mo because you are entitled to get more. Hindi mo nakikita yung ibang tao na nangangailangan na pag kinuha mo lahat, eh, anong kukunin ng iba? Nakakahiya nga eh, kasi humihingi ka lang. Hindi ka bumibili. Nakakahiya nga eh, kasi hindi ka naman tinawag. You're not obliged. But a greedy person, a greedy person, will take everything, notwithstanding of the presence of other people who are in need. At ito nang yayari ngayon, di ba? It is a reality. It is a reality that happens. Naging survival of the fittest. Kung sino yung malakas. sa iyong mabubuhay. And this is not what in the mind of God. In the mind of God is to help us survive. To help us in our difficulties. So if we are self-righteous, if we are self-entitled to what we believe because we are great, then that creates the problem. That creates the problem. Self-entitlement oftentimes creates a crisis in the society. Dahil yung tao na bilib na bilib sa sarili, inaakala niya na Diyos na rin siya. Nobody could correct at sabihin niya, karapatan ko ito. Kaya magulo eh. Sa pagpairal, sa pagpagawa ng self-distancing, ng mask, ng quarantine, mga protocols, kung sino pa ang nagdapat pag-implement ng protocols na ito, sila pa ang hindi sumusunod. Why? Because they are self-entitled. Their authorities. They don't obey. Why they don't obey? I believe because they also do not believe in God. According to a philosopher, Soren Kierkegaard, it is hard to believe because. It is hard to obey. Sana po, magtulungan tayo. Tingnan natin, hindi lamang ang ating karapatan. Ngunit, tingnan din natin ang karapatan ng ibang tao. After all, Jesus has been faithful to his teaching to that. When the people around him questioned, how did this man get his education when he had no teacher? They are just telling to themselves that, Sino ka ba? 
Karapatan namin ito ang dapat ang magturo. Kami ang dapat magturo. Saan ko ba nang kaling? Sino ba yung teacher mo? But Jesus answered them, My doctrine is not my own. It comes from Him who sent me. Any man who chooses to do his will will know about this doctrine. Whoever speaks on his own is bent of self-glorification. Ito ang dapat natin tandaan. Kung believe na believe tayo sa ating sarili, we make ourselves like an authority. Siguro baka sabihin pa natin, we make ourselves as gods, parang Diyos na rin. Dahil believe na believe ka sa iyong sarili. And this is not the teaching of our Lord. Jesus is the true and righteous one because first, He was sent by God. He was sent by God. He taught God's truth. Tinuro niya sa atin ang katotohanan. And He always speaks about God's glory and His works are coming from God. His miracles. Jesus did that for God, not for Himself. Mga kapatid, Hilingin natin kay St. Catherine of Siena na tulungan tayo mag-discern, mag-reflect, mag-contemplate about the presence of God. St. Catherine became famous because of his, of her belief in God. Her obedience to God. Her obedience to the will of God is the proof of her belief in a true God and in following the footsteps of our Lord Jesus Christ. St. Catherine is an ordinary woman, but he did this because of her obedience to God. Like Saint Catherine of Siena, we can do it. We can do it. If we know how to obey and live the will of God. You understand? United as one, let us present our prayers to the Lord through the intercession of Saint Catherine of Siena. Let our response be, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. For all those who are consecrated to God in the service of the Church, may they persevere in their work and collaborate with generosity in building up the Kingdom of God. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For wealthy nations, that they may use their means to relieve the suffering of poor countries and help their development. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For those who are in need of our help, may no one be in want of our prayers and charity. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the religious women of the Dominican order, that, following the example of St. Catherine of Siena, may they dedicate themselves to preach God's Word and to serve the Church. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For Pope, the College of Bishops, parents, relatives, benefactors, and all those whom we promise to pray. 
Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For justice, peace, and development of our country, and for our brothers and ministry at San Lorenzo Ruiz and Companion Martyrs and Most Holy Rosary. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For those who are celebrating their birthdays today, especially for Father Raynor Munseak Opi, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa, and for our personal intentions. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For all of us gathered here, may this Eucharist make us be more aware of the needs of those who live and work with us. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Father, listen to the prayers of your children. May we decide to do your will always and accept with love what you give us. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated. Please stand. Pray, my dear friends, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. Lord, accept this gifts you offer on the feast of our sister Catherine. By following her teaching and example, may we offer perfect praise to you. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is to be right and just, our duty and our salvation. Always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, through Christ our Lord. We praise you today because you revealed to St. Catherine the unsearchable mysteries of your own life and give her a special love for your church. She contemplated you in constant prayer and pleaded that this court might give way to unity. Obedient and humble, she challenged the Church of Christ to be mindful of its mission and be a faithful spouse of Christ, holy and spotless until the end of time. And so with the church and all the angels and saints, we praise your glory as we say,
Holy Lord, the font of all holiness, make holy therefore this gifts you pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dew fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and gave him thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks. He gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we might be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit, Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis our Pope and Socrates our Archbishop, Fidelis his assistant, Gerard our Master of the Order, the religious and all the clergy. Remember our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, with our Father Saint Dominic, Saint Catherine of Siena, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life, and we praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. stand. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say. Thank you. 
Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that with the help of your mercy, we might be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I love you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant our peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Please kneel. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
Please stand. Eternal God, receive the sacrifice of my life for your church. Accept my heart and impress upon it the face of your Son, Jesus. Alleluia. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised to hold that he will save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers, and to remember his holy covenant. This was the Moses word to all our Father God, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, all the righteous in his sight, all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare His way, to give His people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us. To shine on those who dwell in darkness and, and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in our beginning, is now and will be forever. Eternal God, receive the sacrifice of my life for your church. Accept my heart and impress upon it the face of your Son, Jesus. Alleluia. Let us pray. O Lord, may our communion at this heavenly table bring us to eternal life. For it was here that St. Catherine found nourishment all her earthly days. We ask this to Christ our Lord. Amen. We'll now pray the Oratio Imperata for vocations. Let us turn to Mary, help of Christians for the increase of priestly vocations in the church in Linga in Dagupan. Let us answer together, grant through your prayers many vocations to the priesthood. Grant your prayers, many vocations to the priesthood. You accompanied your son on his way to Calvary, walked with our seminarians in their journey of priestly formation, Mary, help of Christians. Grant your prayers, many vocations to the priesthood. You are the mother of the Good Shepherd. Inspire your youth to follow the voice of your son and courageously answer his call to be shepherds. Mary, help of Christians. Grant your prayers, many vocations to the priesthood. You were with the apostles in prayer on Pentecost Day. Stay with us in prayer so that the fire of the Spirit may descend on, your, on our young men seeking their vocation in life. Mary, help of Christians. Grant your prayers, many vocations to the priesthood. Your son entrusted to you, the beloved disciple, the foot of the cross. Take into your immaculate heart, O young men, who are reluctant to answer the call to be priests. Mary, help of Christians. Grant your prayers, many vocations to the priesthood. Let us pray. Mary, help of Christians, we place all our young men under your motherly protection. 
inspire them to serve the church as priests of your son. Take under your motherly care our seminarians being formed for the priesthood. Accompany with your help your priests, sons, as they follow your son, who is Lord forever and ever. Amen. Before the final blessing, I would like to give thanks to each and everyone for your presence during this Mass. I would like also to uh, thank our Facebook and YouTube viewers as well as our radio listeners. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Mass is ended. Let us go in peace. Thanks be to God. We will now have the blessing of our sick brothers and sisters. Please remember uh, your loved ones who are sick and were not able to come for this blessing. Our hope is in the name of the Lord. Who made heaven and earth. Let us pray. God our Father, by your blessing, you give us strength and support in our frailty. To be kindness to our sick brothers and sisters, free them from all illness, and restore them to good health through the intercession of our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this to Christ our Lord. Amen. For your religious articles, in memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, may all these rosaries, images, candles, oil, and other religious articles be blessed and made holy in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.